is that? I'm, I'm nervous of asking you this. But what... No, please don't be. OK. Because I will answer. I know, that's what, it, that's, <laughs> that's what makes me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> OK, it, what is the story uh, about you meeting an American man in Cambridge? When I was a student? Yes. Yeah. That was before I was a lesbian. I was just... Um, <laughs> I was sorting myself out, yes. and um, as you do at, at, at university, and I was on my bike because we we cycled over the cobbles. I would imagine. <laughs> Dive on a bike, and um, <laughs> and we stopped at the traffic lights. And I turned, I looked to the left or the right, as it, whatever it was, and there was a car, an open car, with an American soldier inside. And something crazy took hold of me then. You know that feeling. I've got it right now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I said, would you like to follow me to my college and I'll suck you off? <laughs> You knew you recognised her from somewhere. Exactly. <laughs> I was just... Well, I was still in knee pants at the time. <laughs> anyway, go ahead, go ahead. Finish that story. <laughs> I, think we, I, think we know, I think we know what happened right now. Yeah. The really interesting thing was... That, um, he afterwards... And, and I should explain... I thought I was being a good girl <laughs> because a bad girl would have had intercourse. <laughs> With a random stranger from the street. <laughs> sure, for sure. Well, I still think it was the right thing to do. <laughs> I'm sure he felt the same way. Well, did anyway, did after judges? it was all over, he said, could I come back next week because I've got some friends here. <laughs> to be on one of your shows that will actually air. 